Isaiah chapter 52 verse 6 to 8 Therefore my people shall know my name. They shall know that in that day I am he who speaks. Behold, it is I. How beautiful upon the mountains are the feet of him who brings good news, who proclaims peace, who brings glad tidings of good things, who proclaims salvation, who says to Zion, your God reigns. After weeks spent in seclusion, hidden in the secret place, in God's counsel, in deep prayer for yours and my miracle, Pastor Alf Lukau makes his way to the sanctuary where thousands of men and women await to receive that which God has set for them. My, oh my goodness, Pastor Arthur is making his way into the auditorium right now. Family, the atmosphere is charged. The glory of God is increasing in this place. People are tired of a mediocre life. People are tired of sickness. People are tired of mediocrity. I am telling you, family, after we are marinated, after we are salted, our lives will never be the same again. Family, we're about to go inside for praise and worship right now. And after today, we will all testify of the goodness of the Lord. Hosea chapter 12 verse 13 By a prophet the Lord brought Israel out of Egypt and by a prophet he was preserved. Every time that God wants to intervene in a situation he will send his beloved prophets. All the strain, the bitterness and the pain that the saints have been experiencing sees us today. We will see the greatest manifestation of the supernatural power of God like never before. This is God's dwelling place, and today, God's appointed servant, Pastor Arf Lukau, ushers God's people into the arrest. All glory be to the living God. 